How's it going everybody? It's Ryan and here is a Barton press. This is an exercise made up by a client of mine, actually kind of made by accident. I talked about in the bench press coaching story that I, I left a few days ago and you basically touch your chest, go to 90 degrees and then pause and then follow through. Basically you're pausing at a floor press position or pausing at a partial. And what I found with this kind of an exercise is that you get a good pump in your chest, even with this light of a weight. So if you're looking to find a different way to get some metabolic fatigue, this is kind of a cool way to end a workout, I think. Uh, I can't really push too hard. Oh, here's some partial repetitions. And why am I doing partial repetitions? I'm just kind of curious to know what the difference is. Well, if, if, I do, if, if I made up that exercise and that could be effective, maybe partials will be. Ever since I watched that video with Dave Tate talking about training a movement versus training a muscle, it kind of uh, opened my eyes up to a lot of different things. And then, you know, going through a seminar, I forgot to mention I'm going to another seminar with Stan Efferding and Dan Green uh, on uh, the, I think the 30th, uh, 31st. So I'm pretty excited about that, May 31st. And I'm going to learn more stuff, get more education, and I'm going to write about it, and I'm going to share it on my channel. You know, there's just so many different ways to get strong, so many different ways to learn how to build yourself up. This is the the hobby of strength training, which is powerlifting. It could be bodybuilding. It could be increasing sports performance. But, you know, we're all in this to, like, improve ourselves, and there's so many different ways in which we can do that. And I'm just one perspective. So I hope that with the videos that I make, you can get some ideas. Here I am doing close grip incline press because Dave Tate talked about it helping his speed from the bottom and I thought I'd give it a try. only did one set. So trying different things out, seeing what works uh, and I can kind of fool around a little bit now because I'm hurt and because I'm hurt I don't need to be following anything super intense. I'm just trying to move around and maintain my strength as much as I can which means focusing on variety and doing ways to maintain my muscle memory. I don't want to atrophy at all. So anyways, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.